Gary, a thoroughly well deserved victory against Gateshead. How would you rate the performance? Yeah, very good. I thought um, we played very well. First half, we um, we caused some problems. You know, we got into the final third of the pitch on a number of occasions. You know, deliveries into the box. I thought we controlled the game for large spells. Um, I think sometimes, you know, when you have possession like that, um, you know, some, we go back to go forwards. Um, you know, we use our goalkeeper. Uh, at times to keep possession and manage the game uh, and that's part and parcel of how you should manage games and, and go about the way we want to play and I thought we were good value. Seemed to dominate possession for most of the game, create the majority of the chances, what, <coughs> what key qualities impressed you this evening? I think you just you just said that, you know, we controlled it, the possession was very very good, uh, I thought we looked strong. Um, we created chances, um, final third entries, penalty box entries were very, very good. Um, and obviously we, the goal coming in just before half time was right for us, um, but we nearly switched off as well to, for them to get back into the game just before half time where concentration levels, we wanted it to be higher, but we didn't focus back on the game quickly enough and they had an opportunity which uh, we got away with. But um, overall I'm very, very pleased with the performance. I'm sure you'll highlight Lewis Ward's early save yeah. as being crucial as well. Yeah. That giving Gates didn't give Gateshead a chance to, to get ahead of steam to build their confidence. Yeah, no, it, it's a good point, that um, Gibbo, because you know them saves. You know <laughs> they go unnoticed, but um, as I've said on, on a number of occasions, you know if you you know keepers that we've got here with Wardy and Coley um, make save like that, they're just as important as your as your goal scorer. So uh, it was a yeah, it was a critical save. The corners seem to be a key part of, of your plan this evening. I think in, in the warm-up, Jim Kellerman and, and Lewis Kinsella were trying to whip them in directly into the net. Was that something that you were you were looking to do or, or just to change it around to a bit of freshness? Well, I was bitterly disappointed uh, a few games ago with our deliveries and you know we've made a, a, big, a big effort, if you like, to get players who can deliver it into certain areas and obviously we've watched their games uh, over the last few weeks uh, and how they set up at corners um, and the near, po near post area was uh, an area that we thought we could exploit and the deliveries in there were very good but we just didn't get the first contacts uh, on, on enough occasions for me but uh, the deliveries were very good. Were you relieved to get the, the deserved reward just before half time? If if it had gone in at nil-nil, would it have been a little bit frustrating for you? Um, no, because we were, uh, I thought we were in control of the game. Um, okay, uh, in hindsight now it's quite easy because we didn't score in the second half. So it was a critical moment and a, cr a critical time to score a goal because they'd come in, you know, they may have a little bit of momentum going into the second half, but, you know, we were able to get back on the front foot again I felt in the second half but um, you know we did control it we managed the game very very well and you know managing the game to take the sting out of the game is uh, a tactic that you can use and you can't get it forward all the time because you're just giving possession away and we have to understand that um, and we're a possession based team so why give possession away cheaply um, so we managed the game very very well I thought. So you were confident that the goal would come in the natural run of the game without wanting to force it just before half time? I'm always confident um, when it hits the back of the net. <laughs> and we were fortunate that uh, the linesman was in a very good position uh, to, to be able to, to give us that goal. Uh, and rightly so, there was no complaints from uh, Gateshead side. So um, it was clearly over the line and the, the linesman was in a very good position to give it. And after his frustration at that end against Maidenhead where the ball may or may not have crossed the line where he was perhaps unjustly flagged offside, Scott Rendell finally got his reward. Yeah, no, look, he's, he was ill at the weekend and, you know, um, I spoke to him Saturday morning and he was bitterly disappointed and so uh, all the players and the staff were that he wasn't going to be involved in the game. But um, he's put in a shift tonight as well and uh, he's got his rewards. The second half was still on the front foot, it was still dominating possession but as you say the, the team closed the game out really professionally and that as fluid and, and attacking and as vibrant as the first half had been 
those qualities in the second half must be just as important and just as pleasing for you. Yeah, I was pleased with that. Um, you have to manage the game. Um, you have to. You can't go gung ho all the time and uh, get it forward all the time and smash it forward and, uh, and give possession away. If you do that, everyone gets frustrated. But you know, sometimes frustration is shown because we we go backwards. And uh, but we're keeping possession of the ball. It's done for a reason. And you know, there's been a number of times, not only tonight but through the course of the season, where we've gone back to either Wardy or Coley, and it started off with tax. So. Is a method in the madness. Absolutely, and, and long may that madness continue. I think the team are up to third tonight. It sets up the last home game of the season, of the regular season against Barrow on Saturday very nicely. It's in our hands, it's as simple as that. And if we can get a big crowd, a massive crowd here, a positive crowd here Saturday to help us achieve uh, what we want to achieve, that'd be brilliant. Um, the players have put themselves in a fantastic position, uh, they've worked very very hard you know we had a disappointment at Saturday and how they responded today was very very good very professional and they got their rewards. Excellent congratulations Gary thank you very much. Thank you.